Hey guys, so I'm in my van right now. We just finished building the bed for my son. We have been really, really struggling with how to get the logistics of it to work because he's actually gonna be over our feet. We tried a hammock style bed, which ended up not working. Um, I'll show you what it looked like before I take, took it down. Um, and we went through a lot of trial and error to try to figure this out, but I think it's gonna be perfect and we can fold it up, put it away, and it's super simple to put together. And I think I, um, I love it really. So we haven't tested it out for a full night, but my son has laid on it. I mean, um, he seems to be doing okay with it. So let me just show you what our original idea was and what we ended up with. So let's get into it. So this was our original idea was to have this um, hammock style bed that attaches to some webbing that goes outside the car and carabiners uh, attached to paracord. Uh, but the problem that we've had with this is that it is too flexible. I thought the PVC pipe would give it a little bit more rigidity, but um, either just the pipes I bought or the size I bought, it does not do that. So let me just kind of show you what happens if I just put my weight of my hand in. So it goes down like super far. And with my idea of having mine and my husband's feet go here, that wouldn't be good because um, once you get a full child on here, it would probably hit us on our feet. So you can see these pieces of wood here. This is our new plan to make something solid, but something that's also modular so we can take it apart and it won't be uh, in the way when we're driving. So I'm going to show you how that turns out. After trying to figure it out, I think we finally have it figured out. So this is the bed platform. Let me just go through, kind of show you the details of what it is. And so you can see how this works. So first you can see there's a whole bunch of ropes. These are all attached through holes that we drilled into the wood directly. And we have them going to a carabiner, which goes to this uh, nylon webbing that is tied onto our roof racks. And the ones in the back go to the nylon webbings that ties to our hinges in the back of our van door. So this does hinge in the middle, which actually made it a little bit tricky to try to figure out how to get it to not bend when you're laying on it. If it was flipped over with the hinges on the bottom, you could kind of hear a cracking all the pressure went into the hinges which they're not meant to withhold and if it was flipped this way the way it is it wanted to fold on itself so even with all of these ropes it still wanted to fold so we had to uh, make this underneath so basically um, if you saw those four bolts up here these are holding uh, these pieces of wood down here in place from sliding out but Let's see if you can see. This here is uh, just a piece of wood that's screwed directly into the bed frame as well as all of these are screwed directly into the bed frame. This piece of wood, however, um, right here, slides out. It can go that way, slide that way. But as you can see, the same thing goes for this one as well. There's two of them, two sets. Um, both ends are secured with those uh, brackets and this bolt uh, is what's keeping it from coming out this way. But it just slides right in and it keeps it from wanting to bend. It actually makes it a really nice, firm uh, platform. And also you can see the, the ropes are kind of going under the lengthwise of the bed to kind of give it a little bit of additional support to keep it from wanting to bend. So the sides, you can see these are just pieces of wood, basically the same wood we use for the bed up top. They slide right behind the seat and just kind of give it a little bit of end support. And they're on both sides. And it's, that's everything. That's what it is. And we tested it out. My son actually can lay all the way across because it's 60 inches long. And he's, you know, five, four and a half feet or so. And so it's perfect for him. So I just wanted to show you what it takes to get onto the bed that we built. So Jay, go ahead and show them how to get on. What? How is it, Diego? Good. Good. All right. 